hi everybody it's Doreen and welcome back to day number six so for today's video we are going to be making Mrs. Claus we made Santa Claus on day five so now we're gonna make Mrs. Claus and this is once again a snapdragon snippets cut file and I'm gonna give you the link to the studio file so you don't need the designer edition of the silhouette software and I'm also going to add their Facebook page now they didn't have instructions on their website for putting Mrs. Claus together but she's put together just the same way Santa Claus is except you don't have to add the belt so I'm gonna bring her up and let you see what she looks like so this is Mrs. Claus so now what I've also done is I decided to go ahead and add the Peachy King face instead of using the cut files that came with the file. So come on and join me and I'm going to show you how I put Mrs. Claus together. Okay everybody so you're going to lay Mrs. Claus out the same exact way you did Mr. Claus or Santa Claus on your mat so I'm not gonna go over how to lay everything out because you can just follow what we did for day five for the Santa Claus so let's bring up the supplies now the only difference is Mrs. Claus doesn't have a belt so you won't have to worry about lining up your belt pieces but you're still gonna score all of your pieces as you did with the Santa Claus so I've got all my pieces here these are my fronts and then here's another front and then we have our back pieces which there are four of those so we're gonna go ahead and start putting our pieces together so we'll start with the back first or you can start with the front however you want to do it and we're just gonna line those up and before um, we even do that I'm gonna show you I did decide to go ahead and put my face together and this time I decided to use the Peachy King stamps because I really liked the way the faces are for the Peachy King stamps and this stamp set is the number for this is PK640 and it's called the Princess Face Assortment so I'm using the one inch and I'm using this face right here so I've already added my face and then what I did was I took my Becca pins which look like this sorry for that glare and I colored in the lips and then I put just a little shadow in between on the eyes area here and then I took my uniball pen and put in the white for the eyes and then I just took my sharpie and then just darkened that up a little bit and did a little darkening on the eyelashes just so they would show up a little thicker so that's my face and then of course you know I had to add my bling for her earrings naturally so let's go ahead and start gluing these pieces together here so we got this one so I'm gonna use my beacon again and I'm just gonna start by gluing things together and naturally my beacon needs to be unplugged again I have yet to figure out how to keep that so it doesn't get plugged up so we're gonna go ahead and I probably should have went that way well, we'll just flip that over and line that up like so. And I got a little rough here on the edge when I was pulling off the paper off my silhouette mat. Now remember what I said, you want to make sure that these line up so I'm a little off. So I'm going to pull this apart and as you can see that beacon really sticks. I've actually used this to stick glass to glass and it works perfectly I've tried using the E6000 for sticking to glass 
and I ended up having to do it twice. I put the beacon on once and it is still sticking together. So far anyway. And it's been about two months. So must be pretty good. So now let me get my next body. And I am going to go this way. And I'll get some glue on there. And add my next one. So I'm going to continue gluing these on. And then I'm going to come back once I have them all glued on. So we can put our front with our back. Okay, everybody, so I've gone ahead and I've put my Mrs. Claus together. I took my front pieces and glued them to my back pieces. I've also gone ahead and added the little tassels on the top for her head and or for her cap. And then I've also gone and added the mittens covers on the front and the back. Now, the one thing I want to point out is when you're putting your front together, you need to remember that you're going to glue the front pieces or these tab pieces together first because what you want is this space right here because you need to be able to get your face on here and you want to have just a space between there. Um, I accidentally when I made this the first time, the Mrs. Claus, I wasn't paying attention to how I was gluing it and I put the tabs together and there was not enough space in between the face. So just something I wanted to point out. And then you have your right and left um, arms and hands. So the next thing we need to do, and I also went ahead and added some more of that Snow Rider that I added on Mr. Claus that looks like this, and it's by Deco Art. And I added that along with this glitter dust which basically to me is just some um, glitter. So now we need to add on our face. And I have gone ahead and done the same thing with the face, or uh, with her, the top of her cap. I've gone and put some of that Snow Rider on there, and I've got my accent glossy, or glossy accent on the hair. So we're just going to add her face, and it's going to go right there. So let's get the glue out and we'll put that on and then we'll be ready to add some more embellishments and I'm going to add on the front here. So I first want to get this side on so I'm going to fold in my tab and we're going to kind of line the face up with the top or the bottom scallop of her hair and we'll get our glue on there and I'm just going to get a little bit of glue and I'm going to hold that in and hold that just for a second and then I'm going to kind of go ahead and add the other side so I'm going to do this you don't need to see me gluing this off camera. So I'm going to go ahead and add her face and then I'm also going to add some embellishments and I'm going to come back with the finished Mrs. Santa. Okay everybody so I am back with Mrs. Claus and this is what she looks like. So what I did was I finally got her face on and I want to point out when you put the face on you should get the tabs closer to the ears or where I right below that last scallop where I put the earrings at or the bling rather you should probably put it down there because I did have it down at that first scallop and her face was kinda down too low so I moved it up a little bit and put it there and then I just went ahead and added this little fur trim down at the bottom of her dress so I've added it all the way around like so and I just picked this up at um, Joann's so that's it everybody 
This is my Mrs. Claus. And this is, let's see if I can set it that way, day six of Christmas with Silhouette. So now, don't forget to come back for day number seven. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye.